What is up everybody and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Katie and I'd love it if you hit the subscribe button for more shop with me videos like today. Today's video is a Trader Joe's shop with me and let me just start off by saying that fall is definitely my most favorite time to shop at Trader Joe's. All of the treats, everything you can imagine that's pumpkin and themed and fall with apple and cinnamon and everything delicious. They literally have cakes and breads and bagels, cream cheese, everything pumpkin flavored, you name it, they have it. And it's all at a really good price too. That's the number one reason I love Trader Joe's so so much like look at that caramel apple pie like what does that not look so delicious you could literally throw any of these on a sheet and bring them to a party and just pretend like you made them not that I've done that or anything but hey sometimes you're just in a pinch In my opinion, some of the best items you can buy at Trader Joe's, if not the best items, are the ready-made dips. Brian and I definitely have a difference in opinion on what dips are the best ones, but I think that they're all good. Another really cool thing is all the ready-made soups, perfect for this time of the year. I live in Florida, so it doesn't really get cold, but soups are still nice for when the weather gets a little bit cooler. The golden star aisle of Trader Joe's is absolutely the frozen aisle, and you might think, ew, frozen food, it's so gross, but no. Trader Joe's frozen food is insane. The selection that they have, like this rice cauliflower bowl, they also have like really, really good stuffed shells, they have all these mac and cheeses, anything you could imagine, acai bowls, literally any single thing that you could imagine, they have it in the frozen aisle at Trader Joe's. They have these cauliflower latkes that we love, they have all different styles of cuisine as well. Here's like all the Indian food, they also have like all cauliflower pizzas and just really, really creative stuff and the crazy thing is that it actually all tastes so good which most of the time when you think frozen food you think lean cuisines erase that thought from your mind when you're approaching the frozen section at Trader Joe's trust me If you don't shop at Trader Joe's very often, then you might not know that they have a really, really cool craft beer assortment. They also make their own beers. Here I was looking for the Speculoos, Speculoos cookie butter beer. I don't know how to say that word, but that cookie butter beer that everyone's talking about all over social media. Fortunately, I haven't yet been able to find it, but here is my favorite section at Trader Joe's, the cheese section, and this is my favorite cheese, the creamy Toscano, and it's soaked in Syrah, like Oh my god, it is so, so good. They have so many good cheeses here. Me and Brian love coming here and picking out a new cheese. Each time we go, we each get to pick our own, and then we get to practice our new little charcuterie board setup that we have going for us on our new charcuterie board that I actually showed you guys in my last video in my Home Goods Shop With Me video. And the last part you need to check out before you go is the checkout section. This is where they're going to put really new stuff that's super easy to grab and super tasty. Okay, we just got back from Trader Joe's and we honestly didn't really get that much stuff. We're going on a trip pretty soon and we'll be staying at my house this weekend. We kind of go back and forth from Brian's house and my house. So we didn't want to get that much stuff. We pretty much just got stuff for dinner tonight and like snacky stuff that we love. So I'm just going to show you what we got really quick. So I'm just going to grab what's first in front of me. We got a head of romaine lettuce. We pretty much got them to just supplement these salad bags. These are the Southwest Chop Salad. I don't really like these that much. Brian likes them a lot. They're 
just like all cabbage and it's chopped salad so I just find it super hard to eat but they are pretty good I like the dressing and I like it better if you like supplement it with romaine or iceberg lettuce I think it's better like that Keeping with the produce, we got a bag of Brussels sprouts. My favorite way to eat these is air fried. They're like Italian style Brussels sprouts and we eat them with marinara sauce. If you guys would want a tutorial or recipe about how we make those, I'm definitely up to do that because it's something that we eat all the time and we absolutely love them. We got a couple lemons because we drink a ton of lemon water, especially Brian, he loves his like warm lemon water in the morning. So we got some lemons. And then for dinner tonight, we're doing um, these turkey meatballs with the cauliflower gnocchi. So I'm really excited about that. We're gonna have it with the vodka sauce. So that will be super good. And we're also gonna have it with broccoli. So we got broccoli as well. And then we got this kettle cooked chicken soup. This shopping experience at Trader Joe's was so different for me because it almost felt like I had never been there and I was shopping there for the first time because I'm actually eating meat again. If you guys didn't watch my last vlog, then you wouldn't know that I'm actually eating meat again. So I felt like I could like look at everything and everything was so different and there was a bunch of stuff that I had never had before. So I picked up this chicken soup because I haven't had chicken noodle soup in forever and I'm really, really excited about it. We also picked up two of our favorite dips. Well, this one is my favorite. Brian actually doesn't like this dip, but this is the cauliflower jalapeno dip. It is blended with cream cheese, ricotta cheese, and Parmesan cheese and jalapenos. Brian just doesn't really think that it has any flavor, but I think it has a lot of flavor and I love it. So I would definitely say give it a try. I also love ricotta cheese and cream cheese and stuff like that. So I think that it's super, super yummy. We like to eat it with these longboard tortilla chips that Trader Joe's makes. These are really, really good as well. I highly recommend these. Also to eat with those longboard chips, we picked up our favorite salsa. This is the extra hot habanero salsa from Trader Joe's. It's really, really good and it actually is spicy. So I would definitely recommend it it's super good if you like spicy stuff pick this up and then the very last thing that we got from Trader Joe's was this pumpkin bread mix this is just the classic pumpkin bread mix from Trader Joe's a lot of times this time of year when you go it's sold out so I definitely wanted to pick some up because last time we went it was sold out and then the time before that when I picked some up I used it to make these pumpkin brownies that I actually found on the Trader Joe's website I'll link the recipe down below everything you need is in this box and then just like a couple extra ingredients and it's with icing and stuff oh my gosh they're really really good and they keep really well um, too. They like stay really soft and chewy. So I would definitely recommend that. I'll leave that link down below. Um, it's a Trader Joe's recipe that they actually recommend. That is everything we got at Trader Joe's. It was a really quick haul and really quick shopping trip, but I still wanted to take you guys along, show you some of my favorites, and I'll definitely be doing more Trader Joe's videos. So if you want to see more Trader Joe's videos and hauls, give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and we will see you next time. Bye guys.